What up, guys? It's your girl, man. And me, let me make sure my mic is working. Yes, and I am back with more Lucifer. We are on season six, episode four. If you're enjoying this reaction series or anything else, go to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I'm mean, here. Let's be here together down below. Let's get some comments to my Patreon. It's patreon.com forward slash Manny Meeks. And over there, I have full link version of my reactions as well as YouTube clearance, like the access series. And also, have a merch shop with t shirts, hats, hoodies, mugs, all types of things, original designs on them. So, if you want to support me monetarily, those are your two options. I got my Patreon and I got my merch shop, but you need to support monetarily. one free monetarily. How? You may ask, subscribe. Why? Be out this free. Okay. It costs zero dollars. Hit the subscription button and notification bell. Be notified of my videos for free, y'all. For free. Right? So, Last time on Lucifer, we found out that the mystery Chicky Poo who's sitting on the throne in hell, walking around with pointy angel wings is in fact Lucifer's daughter. I, sh I felt like I should have guessed, but I was just like, bitch, who are you? <laughs> Why are you here trying to mess stuff with the mess? Um, so pretty much um, Lucifer is still trying to get his feet into like feeling like he's God, where feeling like he cares about other people. And he... He's taking Linda's advice because she didn't really give any advice and she's flipping it and he's flipping it to try to make it apply to him, which was find somebody he doesn't care about, help them to see if he can do it. And throughout this whole entire um, video show episode, he learned that through helping Jimmy, the person who shot like episode one villain, Jimmy, who actually died in a mental institution, um, shot Chloe. He wanted to help him in the afterlife. And that's what he did. But he realized that being God was more than just finding someone you didn't like and helping them anyways. It was finding someone you didn't like and still being empathetic and sympathetic towards their plight while helping them achieve what they needed to achieve. And that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool of Lucifer because he realized that he still hated him for what he did, but he still wanted to help him and try to get him the best to get him to be the best place and the best person that he could be. And I'm not mad at that. I am not mad at that. So um, that was a pretty interesting story. But on the other hand, I don't even remember her name. Did she ever say her name? I don't know. Uh, blood tipped angel thingies. The other angel um, went to Dan and was like, hey, let me pull you out of hell and take you back up to earth. Because I, he said that, you know, he couldn't do that, but I can do that. All angels can do that. Anybody with the wings can do that. So she brought him up there thinking that um, Dan was going to do what he said. But Dan went up there and was like trying to warn Lucifer, but Lucifer wasn't there, of course. And um, Dan's such a good guy. He was like, I came up here to warn my friends. I'm not following you. And I'm just like, ma'am, if you could have just said this all along, Dan would have helped you. Not because, oh, you're going, you're trying to kill Lucifer, but because you're his daughter. He's trying to get you guys together. He would definitely try to get you guys together. Super simple. But, um, oh yeah, and Aminadel started his job, which was really cute because Maze went to support him by being a, <laughs> a vandalizer. <laughs> Is that a word? Vandalizer? We're going to call it that. Um... A vandal, is that the word? Vandalizer, I like that better. And um, it was cute. Tis cute, tis cute, tis cute. But they actually said that they cared about each other, which is good because everybody's friends and family, so I don't even know what the big deal is. But um, towards the end of the episode, Lucifer found out that his daughter is trying to kill him. And I think there's something going on with Chloe and Aminadel's, um strength stick, Giggity. It's, it's, it's warping her. It's making her real aggressive all the time. And I don't know if Lucifer is picking up on it yet. But on that note, let's go ahead and jump into season six, episode four. Pin the tail on the daddy. Okay. Look, you can't be my daughter because angels can't procreate. A minute he'll did. Not helping, Daniel. Lucifer, look me in the eyes and tell me. Bruh, who are you? Tell me I'm not your daughter. Bro, I don't know. Who's your mother? Who's your mother? I'm actually glad you abandoned me. Wouldn't want you to be my dad anyway. Why don't you just do a paternity test? My screen is real orange. It's probably because it's blue, but I'm okay with that. I was feeling guilty for betraying you to Michael, but I just saved your life. So even Steven, huh? Up we go. I think his guilt might be more about Trixie than anything. Wow. You know what, man? You have no idea what's right for me. You stay away from me. Um, it's impossible. Where are you going? Where are you going? But where are you going, Daniel? You. 
What's wrong? I just need to take care of a little misunderstanding. But what I happened? He's fine. Um, no, this is something else, which will be cleared up in no time, and then we will be off to heaven. You should have told her. You should have said something. Your face should have faced it. Hmm. Sounds like someone I know. Maybe she is your daughter, Lucy. Ha ha. Do I need to remind you that angels cannot produce offspring? And need I remind you of your nephew? <laughs> Chance that Charlie could grow up to be an angel as well. Maybe his wings will pop out of puberty. Oh, yes. The three signs of puberty. Acne, pubes, and wings. Come <laughs> For once, he's right. For once, he's right. <laughs> Hang on, I did pop up to celebrate the end of the 90s. Falcons, Broncos, Super Bowl 99, Miami. Epic party, lots of bodies, very few clothes. It's starting to sound like congratulations are in order. Just do a, a freaking paternity test. Like, wouldn't somebody be able to, like, tell? <laughs> hey, Daddy. Ooh, hey, Daddy. Well, that's where you're mistaken, buddy boy. I am here to prove that I... I am not a daddy. And nobody's daddy. <laughs> Ella, it's me. It's Dan. Can you hear me? Ella, can you? <laughs> Dan? Is that you? Wait, can you smell me? What? You recognize my Axe body wash? You see me leaning in like, can I smell it too? But it's a little weird. He hasn't returned my texts or calls. I mean, I'm nervous about the God thing, so maybe he is too. He's probably just off somewhere trying to- Oh my God, or a minute they'll say something. Just, I just don't know why he would just tell me what he's up to. Well, you're both past the point of guessing games. Ask him? Why don't you ask him? I'm just, listen, I'm very direct. I will gladly ask anybody what I'm feeling. Especially if I'm feeling inky about it. This app that I have sort of just tells me where he is. He's where? 10,000 seems a tad superfluous. Well, you did come down here for one night in the 90s and managed to orgy it up with 36 people. It was Y2K. People were getting jiggy with it left, right, and center. <laughs> one down, three to disprove. I'm not the father. <laughs> Oh, well, she looks refreshingly unfamiliar. Thank me, I'm not the dad. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you, a father, that'd be disastrous. I mm. beg your pardon? You're not the sticking around type. No. Ma'am, can you get your life together? Hmm, well, if you want to be a dad so Crawl bad. up in these overrays. Crawl up in the overrays. Lucifer, you haven't changed at all. <laughs> I can't believe you were halfway across the country and you didn't even tell me. I'm just here to prove she's not the mother of my illegitimate child. Child? What child? Look, a young lady broke into my penthouse, acting like the devil's spawn and claiming to be one to boot. So, we're all good now. No, right? bro. No. You didn't tell me. I don't want to look like Dan. Oh, yes, that would be a tragedy. Poor guy. His pants were always so tight. <laughs> the first time anyone said anything about me since I got back, except to name a stupid frog after me. She can see you. She's got to be able to see you. Well, as a mother myself, I can't imagine what you're going through. We will help you find your daughter. Thank you. Come on, Lucifer. Come on, Lucifer. Lucifer. <laughs> Who definitely, definitely isn't my daughter. <laughs> well, they can't really do a paternity test. I know, I know, because of the angel situation. But I'm still like, seriously. You can figure out something to do. Give it to Ella and be like, check. Look how he's still waving at people. Can't Aminadale see him? Or is it just Lucifer? Were you just studying police procedure? Yeah. Yeah, man, I made it into the academy thanks to you. 
What? Yeah, it <laughs> meant a lot to me, you submitting my application. And, and, uh, it's great, man. It's great. Mm. I'm so sorry about getting St upset with you before. Stop I, it. Stop it. Know, Stop it. Stop it. Stop. 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 Yeah. No. I've been feeling bad about that too, man. That's why I didn't come visit. Yeah, 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 yeah. You don't have to explain. No. No. Oh. Right. You're a soul without a body. Yep. And I guess only angels can see me. What's up, Dan? Wait, what? Wait, you can actually see me now? I can see you before. Yeah, I could see you all along. Duh, it's me. <laughs> and nobody is saying anything about them talking to some random person. What? Um, have you flown anyone else before? Only Maze. Oh, and uh, Amenadiel once. He killed a goose with his face, Fabio. <laughs> A young woman accused me of being her father and then rage flew away. What? She's an angel? Why wouldn't you tell me that? I, I don't know. I must have been distracted. What with the death threats and Daniel coming back to Earth? What? Bruh, you're like batting O for, for, for five right now. Then why wouldn't you tell me that you have a daughter? Because it isn't true. I can't keep a secret if I don't know what the secret is. But you keep keeping secrets. Uh, I mean, uh, listen, he's right because he ain't know. And we still don't know. But she's right, but you kept a plethora, a plethora, a plethora, if you will, of secrets from her. <laughs> you got to be honest. You got to be honest. Mm -hmm. Well, could she maybe have worked out there at the avocado stand? Oh, I ran those dirty hippies out over a year ago. I ain't seen them since. Good riddance. If you've run out of questions, I'm busy. Well, actually... <laughs> Tell me, young lady. What do you desire? What is it you desire? I want to go home! Shut up! Get back inside! How dare you treat these ch... Oh. Oh. Sir. Shot trespassers before. I'll do it again. <laughs> Just like, yay! Oh, my God. Yeet! <laughs> Bank him! Bank! <laughs> now their parents can't protect them, so you'll have to deal with me. Okay, Lucifer, put him down. What nah. did you do with Mira? Did you hurt her too? <laughs> She's not here. Where is she? <laughs> is she dead? Where the, where the fuck is she? Then where is she? We will find her. We will. I'm gonna let these, we gotta, we gotta do something with these kids. We gotta do something with these kids. These kids gotta be out here somewhere. We gotta get these kids back home. Exactly. What's gonna happen to them? Be reconnected with loved ones or find safe homes. That second one is questionable. Right. If you go to San Francisco and Mira is the girl who showed up at your penthouse, if she really is your daughter, we will figure this out together. Okay? Come on, sis. I may not be certain of a lot right now. But but I love your face, sure, bitch. I have never loved anyone the way I love you, Chloe Decker. Mm, 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 mm. Go find her. Ma'am, how are you going to get where you're going? You flew out there. You don't have a ride. That should have put, like, dirt in your eye.
You're not the girl from my penthouse. But she was looking for your dad. Why did you just call your mom? Who are you? I, I owe you an apology, both of you. This has uh, been an embarrassing mistake. Why don't you call your mother? She is. Hmm. I thought about contacting her a million times, but I was so angry when I ran away. I said such awful things. I just. Uh. Girl, bye. I was stopped looking for you. I'll call her today. Girl. How do you know my mother? Don't worry about that, girl. Just... Uh, there's a chance I thought I might earn her 18 years of child support due to 15 shallow minutes at a Super Bowl orgy. <laughs> well, what changed your mind? How did you realize that she was yours? No, I think it was the first moment I looked into her eyes. Just felt it in my gut. So, is she? That's the real question. I don't have time for this. I don't have time for this. I don't have time for this. I do not have time for this. <laughs> Please. Please take me back. Daniel, I'm so sorry, but... I can't. Once you reached the mortal plane, you became intangible. Let's just say I know better than anyone what it's like to grow up with an absent father. So why would you do that to somebody else? Purposefully? Congratulations. I, I, I mean, having a daughter, it's... It's the best. I think I may have... I'm a handful. How do we get here? 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 What happened? How, Sway? From what? From what? How? Is she from the future? I've got nothing. I don't. I. I. I don't know how. I'm real orange, but how though? <clears throat> but how though? <laughs> how? Listen, y'all need to quit playing with Dan. Don't show me Trixie no more. If this is how you gonna show me Trixie, okay? Don't show me her at all, cause I don't have time for it, okay? I didn't have time for Minadel and Dan. I didn't have time for Maze and Dan, except for that funny part when she was pretending like she couldn't see him because I figured that she could see him because I'm like, you're a demon. How would you not be able to see a, a soul from hell? You know you can see him. But I'm just like, I don't... I don't want to do this again. I don't, don't want to do this no more. I don't, I'm tired. I don't want to do this again. I'm tired. But man, now I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. So... On that note, guys, thanks for hanging with me, and hopefully I will catch you in the next one. I gotta process what I just synced. I gotta process it. I don't know. I gotta process it. I gotta process. I gotta process.